Supertastic Friends. I have a Dollar Tree haul. OMG. Yes, I know it has been forever since I have been to the Dollar Tree. But I placed an online order for Walmart because I have not been feeling well and I just could not walk through Walmart to do shopping. So, in part of my order, I needed a new broom for inside the house. And wouldn't you know it, they were out of stock. So before I picked up my order, I swung by the Dollar Tree and luckily they had a broom. So because I was already in Dollar Tree, Look what else I found. Yes. So I finally did a little shopping at Dollar Tree. So I'm going to show you all of the cute goodies that I found. And I found some really nice stuff at this Dollar Tree, which is right down the street from my house. They normally don't have a lot. But apparently this day I caught them as they were restocking the shelves. And getting ready for Valentine's Day. So, let's get started. The first thing, or one of the first things I found was a bunch of new vinyl for the Cricut machine. I found this rainbow vinyl, OMG. Don't have any rainbow vinyl. Matter of fact, I want to open this up because I want to see how rainbowy it is. Oh my goodness. Look at that, guys. Isn't that pretty? I hadn't even looked at it until just now, but look at that. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I should have gotten another one of those, but oh well. At least I got one roll. So they got the rainbow one. I also got this pretty like turquoise one. I don't have any turquoise vinyl, so that's the reason why I grabbed it. Also, I picked up this beautiful kind of really um, dark um, hot pink. I don't have any of this color either, so I got that one. And, of course, you know green is my favorite color. My second favorite color is purple. Look at that glittery purple. So, when, that, when I saw this one, yep, had to grab the purple. And they had it in the non-glittered, too. So, I had to get both purples. So, can't beat that. Vinyl for a dollar a roll. You cannot beat that at all. Because even if you don't use it in a Cricut machine, you can still cut pieces out of it and use it for crafting. Okay. Oh, and then the next thing that they had that they have not had in stock for a very long time is the battery-operated pillar candles. So, I picked up several of these, too, because haven't seen them in forever. So, I picked up several of these for crafting. And, um, like I said in the beginning of the video, I picked up a broom while I was there because needed a new inside broom. Also, picked up several packs of the um, sanitary... Um, kitchen sponges because I go through these a lot because I always hand wash my dishes and you don't like nasty sponges so picked up several packs of those and um oh and I also picked up another roll of the burlap and lace ribbon because I'm down to like only a little bit left I use this a lot in crafting You've seen it on several wreaths, and I used a lot of this in my 
best friend's welcome door hanger. So, when I saw it, I picked up another roll just to have on hand. I also, and now I'm going to show you some Valentine's Day stuff, <clears throat> which they already only had some of it out. They had the boxes out, so some of it was up, some of it was not unpacked yet. I found this beautiful um, MDF love sign, and this is so pretty. I love the script. Haven't decided what I'm going to do with it yet, but... I picked up one of those. They also had the wood heart cutouts. So I picked up a couple of these. I'm probably going to do something with those because they're solid wood. And they also had these uh, laser wood cutouts. You get eight instead of five. They're giving you eight. Of these little thin wood cutouts now this one kind of has like a, a lattice kind of looking to it which is all these little hearts in it and I thought those were really pretty so I picked up that design I also picked up the one that had just the heart in the middle cut out and again they're giving you eight instead of five and then I loved this one, too, that had, like, the heart in the middle, but then it also had some little cutouts around it. So I thought those were really pretty, too. Haven't decided what I'm going to do with them just yet, but, you know, hearts can always be used for a lot of things. So very, very nice that you get eight in those packs for oh and that's the other thing i forgot to mention my dollar tree is no longer a dollar i noticed when i was in there that mine has now gone to everything is a dollar and a quarter so i know that not every dollar tree has changed yet but my dollar trees apparently have now made the changeover and everything is a dollar and 25 cents that's still a good deal. So I am not complaining, but my Dollar Trees have already made the changeover. Then I saw these cute little, they're calling them DIY craft kits. And it also comes with a wood cutout. This one says XO or XOXO, but actually the O is a heart. And they're um, giving you the ribbon and the sequins and some stick-on um, rhinestones and stuff so that you can decorate the wood cutout yourself. So I thought that was really cool because I like all the sequins and all the little rhinestones and stuff and the ribbon. There's even like a little rhinestone heart right here. So I got that one. They had three different varieties. Because as you can see, there's all the rhinestones and the hearts and the sequins. And this one, if I can get it to go down. This one says love. And this one is really cute. This one is a the back of a little car. And it says love across the bottom. And then it has two little hearts in the back window. So that one is just two cute so those are really adorable little kits so i got those oh and you i don't know if you've seen my diy homemade coaster video yet i don't know if it's gone up yet but i could not find my cork adhesive that goes on the bottom of the coasters so while i was there i picked up some more of the peel and stick coaster sheets so that I could complete my coasters. So I got some of that. So, and I've already completed them, so I went ahead and put the, the cork on the bottom of the coasters. And I also found the spatula for the Cricut machines. Now, I'd already found the, um, 
the little, oh gosh, my mind's going blank. The um, little pointy tool that helps you um, uh, peel up vinyl. But today I actually found the, the little spatula or scraper that you can use with your Cricut machine. So I picked up one of those. So now I have more than one spatula for my Cricut machine. And, oh, I forgot another Valentine's Day item. Look at these little galvanized metal envelopes. And you can put something inside of it. But look at that. Isn't that adorable? It's an actual galvanized metal envelope. And it's got a little bow and a little heart up here. I think it came in red too. If I remember correctly. But I only picked up just the plain metal one. And it hangs from a little jute string. But isn't that just the cutest that you could fill something on the inside of it? But I mean it's, it's really nicely made. And it is just the cutest. But yeah, I saw that and I just had to pick that up as well. And uh, I'm sorry guys, but uh, with the cold and sinus problems I've been having, I'm just, oh, it's been really hard for me this past week or so. Um, I also uh, found some more of the, um, what do they call these? Glass gems. And I actually was able to find a whole bag of one color in this beautiful blue. And so I went ahead and picked up this bag because, again, it was all one color instead of a mixed color. And uh, so I got those because that's beautiful. I love that color. And I picked up some clothespins. Now, Dollar Tree uh, didn't know this. But they carry three different sizes of clothespins. They carry this in the home section, which is, you know, the regular size that you would use if you have clothes hanging on the clothesline. This is the regular size. And let me see if I have the other ones. Okay, um, I can't find the other ones, but they have these that come in a 24 pack, and this is kind of like a medium size. They're 1.87 inches long, and they also have these itty bitty ones that I think probably are maybe only an inch long. So you can get three different sizes of the clothespins. Um, at Dollar Tree. Now these and the little, the tinier ones are sold in the Crafter Square section. So you'll have to get the tiny ones, the two different smaller ones. You'll have to get those um, in the crafting section. And then these, the regular size ones, are in the home section. So just remember that if you want to get the clothespins, what section that they're sold in. Then I... I've seen a lot of crafters online say they rave about the super glue wood glue and say that it works great. So I finally saw this at this Dollar Tree. So I picked up a bottle so that, because you know, I work with a lot of wood um, gluing it together. So I'm going to give this a try, see how well it works. And if it works really great, I'll. I'll buy some more. So I picked up a bottle of the super glue wood glue from the Dollar Tree. Oh, and the other thing that I found. Now this was not in the per se Valentine's Day section, but it was next to it. I found this cute little piece of home decor. It looks like a little house. And it says, love lives here. Now I don't know if I'll keep it like this, but... A piece of home decor like this that looks like a little house is very popular because you can just put it up and let it stand and put whatever you want on the front. 
So, if you see this, pick it up because you can change whatever's on the front to suit your home decor. Because then, see, it's already made into a little house and you can just change what it says on the front. So, pick that up if you see it. <sighs> okay. Oh, and the next new item that I have already seen someone else on line use and that it's new to me is the pouring medium for acrylic paint so I might be giving this a try because I already have acrylic paint and I already have canvases so you might be seeing that here in the future so I picked up some of this because it was the last on the on the shelf and I didn't want to pass it up so I picked up some of the pouring medium that um, the Dollar Tree is now carrying for acrylic paint I also picked up some of these clear colored pony beads and um, hopefully you'll be seeing a craft project with these um, not anytime soon this is for a craft project coming up at the end of winter so stay tuned for that you'll be seeing that at the end of winter and I picked up two bags of these and um, so stay tuned for that but I picked them up because I saw them and I just went ahead and got them for the future project and oh and then I saw this. It's by a company called Bostic Smart Adhesives. It says it is fine and wide clear glue. It's a dual application pen applicator and spreader applicator. It says it's got a detailed applicator and a wide applicator on the other end. And... It says it's it's supposed to bond paper, cardboard, and fabrics with no mess or fuss. It's ideal for scrapbooks, cut and paste activities, school projects, and paper crafting. So, I was like, okay, that sounds like it's perfect for my crafting. But, I could not find any more of these. I looked in the craft section, I looked in the school section, and I looked in the hardware section. This was the only one I could find. So, but I will be giving it um, a test run and a review, and we're going to see how well this works. And if it works, I'll be on the hunt for some more. And then the last thing that I found that I have been looking for and looking for prior to taking a break from looking at Dollar Tree. But I've been seeing online a lot from other crafting channels is the wood planks. And I finally saw them at my Dollar Tree. Now this one is a six piece and it comes in the size of 7.125 by 2.875. I'll let you see the size right there. And again, that was six pieces. So you get six pieces of rectangular wood for crafting. And I found the other size. It's also six pieces. This one is square. And this one is four and a half by four and a half size. So. And I have seen so many crafters over the past months working with these. But my Dollar Tree never had them. So finally, finally, finally found them at my Dollar Tree. Okay, guys, that was my Dollar Tree haul. And, uh, oh, and of course, you know, I found the broom. So I was able to get a broom for the inside of my home. And now that 
I am out of breath. And I feel like I've got to take this congestion out of me right now. I will ask you to please hit that subscribe button if you are not already subscribed to my channel because that would really help me out and it would help out the YouTube algor algorithm as well. And as always, love, hugs, and kitty kisses. And we will see you guys real soon.